Hey guys, so I'm going to make something super delicious. It is one of my favorite dinner options and it is a gluten-free lasagna with lean mincemeat. I've got a whole heap of ingredients right here. It's gonna be a healthy lasagna because we all like healthy. So these ones here, I've just got the Latina Fresh Gluten-Free Lasagna Sheet. So you can just get these from the supermarket in the refrigerated aisle. I've also got some extra lean mints as well, which I just got from the supermarket too. I like to go with the extra lean because it does have less fat on it too. As you can see, I've got plenty of vegetables here. I've got tomatoes, carrots, zucchini, spinach, mushrooms. And I've also got some diced tomatoes to build the paste as well, to build the minced meat. And then I've also got some red kidney beans, which will also go into the mixture too. So high protein, lots of vegetables, and super delicious. Let's go. So guys, first step, I'm just gonna put the lean minced meat onto the pan and cook it slowly. So just gonna kind of make a little spaghetti base and I'm gonna add some vegetables in there too. So guys, I'm just creating the zucchini and also I just created two carrots as well. And this is going to go straight into the minced meat mixture as well. So this is gonna go straight in. Adding in some mushrooms now. Yum, yum, yum. And just stirring that. I'm just going to add in some spices as well. So I've just got some basil, which is going straight in there. Some salt. Pepper. And also some paprika as well. So as you can see, I'm just using really healthy spices in this one here. So I've got my minced meat that is cooking through right there. Next step, I'm going to start making it a little bit more saucier. So I've just got some nice canned tomatoes. Um, I've just opened them up and that is going straight in there. And then I've also got some red kidney beans as well, just for the extra protein, and who doesn't like some kidney beans? So I'm just gonna put half of that container in. They're already drained too. So I'm gonna let that simmer for about 10 minutes until it's ready. Now my mince is just resting there. I'm going to start layering the lasagna. So I've got a tray here. Next step, I'm just gonna lightly spray it with some cooking oil too. So that's all sprayed up there. So I've also cut up and sliced some tomato, so I'm actually going to layer that within the lasagna as well. I've got my sheets here. I've also gone with the light tasty cheese. You can just get this from Woolies or Coles. It's got a lot less fat in it than mozzarella, everything like that. So I actually always use this cheese, especially when I do nitrous, lasagna, spag bowl, everything like that. It's a lot more healthier. And I'm also going to layer the lasagna with some spinach. Spinach is so volume dense and it's very healthy, so I'm gonna layer it within the lasagna. So let's get building. I need a little builder's hat. <laughs> so guys, I'm just layering my lasagna. So I've got meat, uh, lasagna sheet, tomatoes, and just some spinach. And then what comes next, Peter? <laughs> Another sheet. <laughs> no, the cheese. How can you forget the cheese in the lasagna? All right, let's go again. So meat. It's very healthy as you can see. It is very macro friendly as well. 
So each slice of this lasagna, we're going to put it into four slices, has 40 grams of carbs, 30 grams of protein, and 10 grams of fat, which is absolutely amazing. So this serves four people. We've also got a bit of a side salad to go with it as well. So great dinner option here, guys. You can do it for the family, do it for a date night, whichever you like, but this looks absolutely delicious, and I'm so excited to dig in. As you guys know, I'm a qualified nutritionist, and if you need any meal ideas, or if you're going to jump on board my team, make sure you do. You can also subscribe to my channel so you can get some more tasty recipes like this one. Hope you love this one, guys, and bon appetit. <laughs>